sa mga nag-worry about um, the COVID-19 vaccine, will they take it or not? I'm telling you guys, kailangan talaga natin magpavaksin. We really have to take it. Kasi, um, sabi nga, we will never be really safe until everyone is safe. Means to say, lahat tayo kailangan magpavaksin. is the second dose of my COVID-19 vaccine and uh, I am scheduled at 10.15 a.m. Time check it's 10.09 a.m. So we're here waiting at the auditorium. Uh, we are waiting here to be called batch by batch and then um, we will go through the same process of screening like the first time three weeks ago. So um, as they say, the second dose of vaccine is stronger. So I've been preparing for this, been sleeping. Uh, luckily, it's my day off again tomorrow. So uh, I'll be able to rest before I go back to work on Wednesday. So uh, I'll update you later uh, what's happening. And um, I'll keep you posted. See ya. the vaccine or the weather but mm -hmm. since I had a vaccine I started to have every now and then flu. You feel like you fully conditioned today? Yep, yeah, yep, right. Okay, you might have another, you know, kind of course. Yeah, but maybe because look after yourself. Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. just, yeah. But you still happy to have yep. second one? Okay. It's a bit scary, isn't it? <laughs> yeah, I've been hearing horror stories. You have to do this. Just so you can look after yourself yeah. and then keep yourself warm. Yeah. Okay? Yeah.
everyone is okay. Uh, as expected, uh, madami-dami na sa atin ang nakareceive ng COVID-19 vaccine, lalo na yung mga frontliners. So, let's talk about my second dose of Pfizer experience. So, um, I had that last March 22. So, that was three weeks ago. And, um, the process is shorter and quicker than the first dose. Uh, in, kung nung during the first dose, it took like five screening bago nila binigay sa akin. Bago nila ako in-injectionan. On the second dose, after three screening, I was injected by the vaccine. And uh, katulad din during the first dose, you have to stay in the waiting area for 30 minutes to see and to wait for any drastic reaction. Kasi nga, at least, nandun ka na sa hospital. will be easier to seek for any medical help. Magbibigyan ka nila ng proper medical attention right away if ever na iba yung reaction ng body mo sa vaccine. Ang reaction ko is in 5 minutes, I need to go to the toilet. Nagdayariya ako. And it took a while. Kinakatok na nga ako sa toilet na, Are you okay? Sabi ko, Yes, I'm okay. Uh, babalik. I have to go back sa waiting area. So, nung nakabalik na ako sa waiting area, I'm, I'm already feeling really sick. So, masakit yung mga bones ko, yung muscle aches. Ganun na, nagsisimula. Uh, around my knees, uh, in my spine. As in, flu. Flu talaga. Trangkaso. So, inayaan ko lang siya na matapos yung 30 minutes na waiting period kasi it is expected sinabi naman what to expect then after noon um, I asked for uh, hot water and I drink this lemsip this really saves me sa, so that I won't be really run down kasi kailangan kong pumasok sa work. Although not the next day, but kailangan kasi na huwag maging absent as much as possible. So, March 22, when I started feeling sick, minum na ako ng isang ganito. Wala akong ibang ininom. Uh, the usual, nagpahinga ako ng tulo. Uh, then, I felt better. And then the next day, March 23, I woke up really feeling sick again. Like, ang sakit sa akin ang katawan ko, ang sakit sa akin. So, after breakfast, uminom ako ulit na ito. This is not a sponsored, guys. Sinasabi ko lang kung sino yung mga may itong ganito, may access sa ganito. This really helps. So, on the 23rd, I'm really feeling sick rin. Uminom nga ako nun. And then, nagpahing nga. Uh, natulog na maaga kasi the next day, March 24, I have uh, work. Kailangan akong gumising na maaga for work. And luckily, I'm all good. I don't have to be absent from work. So, yun. Yun ang aking naging experience. And, um, sa mga nag worry about um, the COVID-19 vaccine, will they take it or not? I'm telling you guys, kailangan talaga nating magpa-vaccine. We really, really have to take it. Kasi, um, sabi nga, we will never be really safe until everyone is safe. Means to say, lahat tayo kailangan magpa-vaccine. And um, despite I am fully vaccinated against COVID, I am still taking extra precautionary measures like I still wear uh, surgical mask. I still wash my hands with soap and water for 20 seconds. If no access for water or soap, 
mag hand sanitize. Lagi akong may hand sanitizer sa aking pocket. So, hindi porke na-vaccine na po tayo, eh, magiging lax na tayo. Kailangan pa rin po natin i-continue ang ating pag-iingat kasi hindi pa naman po lahat tayo fully vaccinated. So, yun guys, I'm encouraging everyone na magpa-vaccine. Magpa-vaccine po tayo. Kasi kailangan natin. And maraming salamat. Hope uh, meron ako na-import na uh, knowledge sa inyo about the COVID-19 uh, nakatulong and, um, sa mga tanong-tanong nyo about uh, COVID-19. So, Thank you for uh, supporting my channel, watching my channel. Please, uh, kung hindi ka pa po uh, nakakapag-subscribe sa akin, please like, comment, and subscribe, and hit the notification bell button para lagi kang updated sa mga videos ko. Maraming salamat.